Okay, guys, in this video, uh, I'm going to show the introduction to board plot. So, before you go to introduction, before you go to the board plot, you go back to the previous video. Uh, okay, in the previous, when you see the spawn, you can see that uh, the output graph is in time domain. Time domain. Input also time domain. So, time domain. So, we can see that. Uh, the output is the changes is in magnitude, magnitude and case. The same way, okay, magnitude, changes in magnitude with, uh, with, uh, with A, the output become A times magnitude gain, AM. So changes in magnitude, the output and also changes in. Uh, phase shift. Okay, before that, we go okay, phase shift. So changes in magnitude and changes in phase shift. However, the frequency is single. The okay, same frequency. The output. You want this output frequency, input frequency. Okay, same frequency or single frequency. So ensure that the output of the frequency response is. Uh, in time domain, just plot the changes in magnitude and phase. Okay. Uh, however, if because this one is in single frequency, if we want to to, to visualize visualize the uh, visualize the the gain, the changes of the changes of uh, the gain, changes of gain, and also changes of phase shift. In for for various frequency, we can use body plot. So body plot, body plot. Okay, various things. So gain, uh, so phase, and also for the various frequency. Body plot, body plot, sorry, body plot. Sometimes people call it both plot, sometimes people call it body plot. Okay, in both plot, body plot, it comes from French, French word, body plot. Okay, we have gain. Versus frequency, frequency is on, in omega, radian per second, and also we have to to graph phase, phase in degree, so also in frequency, omega. Ah, uh, okay, frequency. Okay, one is what is ten, so it means that uh, one decay. We use one decade because we want to plot a various or wide range of frequency spectrum. So we use one decade, one decade, one decade. So we can plot a various frequency spectrum. Okay, this one is for phase degree, this one is for gain. Okay, in the, uh, gain, uh, we use power gain. Power gain. Power gain in dB. Power gain in dB. So to use power power gain in dB, we have to convert from the previous one. We we have a magnitude. So the gain uh, we we plot in power. So from the we, uh, from the magnitude, we have to convert to power gain. So to convert this, we use twenty uh, power 
Okay. Now the magnitude. The magnitude. This one is magnitude. Or amplitude. Magnitude gain. So this is the magnitude gain. We plot Q times 20 log O gain. So we got in dB. In dB. There's it bad. So, uh, so from bo body plot, so now from body plot, we can uh, we can visualize the the gain, the changes of gain, and changes of phase, different in various frequency. So various frequency. So we plot whether like this or like this. Or like this, or whatever. So we will uh, analyze this in the next chapter. Okay, to plot uh, their procedure, their step to plot a uh, body plot, for the graph body plot. First, we have to convert. First, we have to convert. Uh, convert open loop transfer function GS. S domain to frequency transmission to uh, w omega domain. So convert S domain to omega domain, we call J omega. Then second, we, uh, we calculate power gain. Power gain in dB. Power gain. We calculate first first for angle. Okay, first to calculate first first angle is imaginary real. So normally it will be like this. This is point okay. okay angle. This angle. This angle equal to equal to Then, okay, this part imaginary divide by this part is real. So, real okay, imaginary divide by real, you got tangent, you got sorry, you got face angle, so to tangent. Then from this from this data we can plot our body plot. So that's all intro to body plot. Thank you.